Welcome to the world of NanoFixit. I'm so happy to see you here today. I'm Mo, part of the team here at NanoFixit headquarters, and I'm going to teach you about NanoFixit, how to sell NanoFixit, and what is the unique benefits that you can talk about to convince the client to purchase this super cool product. Because here is the challenge. This is a new product. People are a little bit uncertain about what it is, how it works, so they will have a lot of questions. The old-fashioned temper glass is much easier to sell because the consumers are already programmed how to use this, that it works, how it works, you put it on the screen, easy, etc, etc. In any case, it's not really something they can do themselves without messing up the results, so they would often ask professionals like you to apply this to their phone, right? Our product is meant to save you, as the salesperson, a lot of time because you can just say, here you go, so easy to do, you can do this yourself in three minutes at home. Or of course, you can help people to do it in the store. NanoFixit is a liquid screen protector. It's made of nanotechnology, and I'll tell you a little bit how it works. Glass has pores, just like your skin. So when you put the moisturizer on your skin, the moisturizer goes into the pores of your skin, right? Now, glass also has pores, but they are much, much smaller. NanoFixit made a special liquid with uh, special nanoparticles in different shapes that crystallizes and actually go into the pores of the screen, fill up the pores like you would pour sand in a coffee cup, fill up the pores, make an invisible shield on top of the screen, which is about mm, eight, 900 nanometers thick. It's completely invisible. In comparison, a human hair is 80,000 nanometers thick. And we're talking about 800 here, so it's very, very, very thin, but very strong. This is the world of nanotechnology, the lovely part about it. So when you have applied NanoFixit to the glass, what happens is that these crystals sit inside the glass and it really makes this bond on top of the screen. So it's very hard to scratch it, harder to break it, and it also has added benefits that I'm going to talk about later. First of all, let's talk a little bit about the product, how it works, and why people should choose this instead of the traditional uh, temporary glass. When I started my career, my professional career, I was a DJ. So when I was a DJ, we played vinyl records. And after vinyl records, CDs came. And then MP3 came. And now we just have some kind of app on our phone and we press the app and you don't even see the music anymore. It just comes to you. Well, for me, Temper Glass is a vinyl record and NanoFixit is MP3, okay? That's how far we have advanced into this technology. It's not a question if this type of technology will be the next technology. It's just a question on how fast it's going to roll out. And that's where you come in, okay? We, together with you, educating the consumers on the benefits of this new technology. So let's talk a little bit about that. Tempered glass has a restriction. And one of the restrictions is that this is fitted for one phone. So in your store, you have a lot of phones and then you have to have one screen protector for each single model. Here's the problem. You don't know how many you're gonna sell. And as you know, the electronics are coming out more and more, so many electronics are coming out. So how do you really know how many screen protectors to have in stock? This is a big waste. We wanted to address this problem, and the way we did it is to make the tempered glass into liquid, nano liquid. It's actually stronger than tempered glass. So let's talk about how that works. Well, first of all, when you have tempered glass on the glass, you need to clean the surface thoroughly. So to do that, you take step number one that is inside the box, and you take it out. Inside here is a polishing pad with special cleaner on it. You rub that thoroughly for about 30 seconds. Use pressure when you do that. I'll show you later how to apply it. Then number two, you take out the nanotechnology itself. This nanotechnology is the only water-based organic nanotechnology in the market. There is no product like it. It's water-based, completely organic and safe for you to use with no toxin, toxins whatsoever, okay? Safe to use, very important to know. 
Now, number two, the three is the polishing. So after you apply the product, you polish it off, okay? So step one, two, three. Quite easy, right? So this is how you apply NanoFix. We're gonna show you a video a little bit later correctly how to apply it because this is very, very important. So what is the benefits besides that NanoFix it fits all sizes, okay? Because you, do, you don't need anything else. You only need NanoFix it in your store because you can use for tablets, or you can use for phone. Any size, one SKU, nice colors on the wall, it works, okay? So what's the other benefits of it? Well, here's a problem with the tempered glass again, okay? Tempered glass, of course, becomes a glass upon the glass. Now you buy a beautiful phone. It's a new phone, whatever the model is, latest model, super cool, beautiful. But now when you put tempered glass on it, would you think that's an upgrade of the phone or a downgrade of your phone, right? So if you put a big piece of glass on this, I would call that downgrading your phone. So you put this on and what happens is that it reduces the visibility and clarity of the screen because of course tempered glass has glue in it. You may not see this the first day, but this comes over time because the gadget has heat, it goes into the glue, and slowly this glue starts to become yellow, it starts to become foggy, and people start using their gadget. It happens so slow, so, so they actually don't notice at the beginning. They will only notice when you take it off and clean their screen and go like, wow, that looks like a new phone. So. It really destroys the visibility. Also, it can affect the sensitivity of the screen. When people put NanoFix it on their iPads or gadgets and they play a game on them, many of the gamers come to us and say, you know what, when I put NanoFix it, I had much more responsive screen. So that could be a good point, couldn't it? So more responsive screen, better clarity. What about the camera lens? There are no screen protectors for the camera lens. The camera lens, you can put NanoFix it on the camera lens, and when you do, it captures light differently. We did many tests before and after on this, and if you contact us, I'll send you a really cool picture of that on an LG phone. Uh, and when you put NanoFix it on this glass, it increases the clarity of the glass. Uh, because inside the glass of the, this camera lens, it actually has a lot of pores, so the light goes in in all directions. But when you put NanoFix it on this, it seals all the pores inside the glass surface, and it actually will take clearer pictures. Especially if you put it up towards the light. Normally in a picture, you know, you will see like light coming down from the sky like this, but uh, like a little angel or something. But with NanoFix it, it's crystal clear. Okay, no foggy. So it increases the clarity of the lens. So, so far, increased clarity of the screen, better sensitive, more speed on the screen, and clarity and protection also of the lens itself. There's a lot of pores inside tempered glass and it gets really fatty and sticky very easily. In many cases, much more than without tempered glass. It kind of sucks fat and bugs, okay? The problem with these phones these days are that they are prone to having a lot of uh, bacteria on them because we use them everywhere, so they're full of germs, okay? So what we want to do is to uh, kill those germs. And NanoFix it, when you put NanoFix it on the screen, NanoFix it has what we call titanium in it. It's a special nano titanium. These titanium particles are activated by light and they kill germs and bacteria. So when you put NanoFix it on the screen, NanoFix it goes into the pores, the titanium gets stuck inside the glass as part of this formula. You turn on your phone, light shines on, and bang, we zap all the bacteria, and now no more bacteria on the screen. So it's a self-cleaning coating for bacteria and germs. That's pretty good, right? Tempered glass, on the other hand, no self-cleaning bacteria function. It just makes more and more bacteria. So this bacteria gets sucked into this foam, it's hard to get out, together with the fat, it kind of sucks. So the bacteria thing, also an issue. The other thing about gadget health is that they have a some kind of radiation. Uh, this discussion about how much radiation and uh, if radiation is good for you or bad for you, well, Google that, you'll find out a lot of information online. Some people say you should hold the device this far from your head always. Uh, if you do this and if the gadget goes, goes warm, it's frying your brain. 
I don't know, I'm not a scientist. They say that we boys, we shouldn't put the phone down in our pants because it can hurt our private parts somehow. Lots of information on this. You can also see it on gadgetsanitizer.com uh, and on our radiation shield commercials. So really this product uh, that we have made, Nanofix It, when you put uh, it on the screen, it seals all the pores in the surface here. And uh, when you put it on your head, the radiation don't go from the glass to your face because we blocked it with our nanotechnology. It goes out this way. So Nanofixit is the only company in this industry that is certified to reduce radiation. We have tried it on Samsung, we have tried it on Apple phones, and it reduces radiation with up to 92-93%, which is a lot, right? So to summarize the benefits of Nanofixit liquid screen protector compared to anything else that is in the market, and especially compared to this old vinyl record, is that number one, it makes your screen ultra scratch resistant. This is 9H, this is 9H+. It also makes your screen free from bacteria and germs. It increases the clarity of the screens, the sensitivity of the screen, and it protects and improves the camera lens. It also re reduces radiation from the gadget. So that's kind of a little bit about the product. Pretty cool, right? Now let's talk about how to sell this product because we have had kiosks like this put up in various malls around the world and we interact with the consumers directly so we know how to sell this product we know the uh, frequently asked questions we know the issues the the challenges we have about this product because it's new technology people have a lot of questions they don't trust it yet because it's something new there's a couple of uh, questions that are always the same questions that people ask us. And the number one question is, how long does it last? Well, when you put Nanofixit on the screen, it will last for minimum one year. We actually think it's gonna last longer, but we say minimum one year. So we have this one year line, also because we wanna present the product again to the customer next year, right? So we say we recommend to apply it every year. So. One year protection, we recommend to apply it every year. Question number two, how do I know that it's there? Because you put Nanofixit on, it's thinner than a human hair and you can't see it. So how do you know it's there? People ask me. Nanofixit makes any surface extremely hydrophobic. So if you take a phone without Nanofixit on and you put water on it, normally you will just have a wet phone. When you put Nanofixit on the surface of your gadgets, you will see that water bubbles like pearls come on top of the gadget. And this is how you can see that Nanofixit is there. And this is how you can see that it still works. If you want to do a test on your gadget later to see if it works or not, if it's still there, you take a little bit of water, you put on the screen. Let me show you how that works. You can put it on here and the water pearls on top of the phone like this, instead of making just a wet, uh, area. It's pretty cool. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to apply Nanofixit, okay? And after applying it, we're going to talk a little bit about how to sell it and how to demonstrate it. So inside this box are three sachets. Step one, clean the foam. Step two, apply the product. Step three, buff the polish, uh, polish on the product. So step one is to clean the product. This is very, very important, okay? Because the cleaning process is about getting glue, fat, residue, out of the pores on the phone that you cannot see. So spend time doing this. It's much more important to clean the phone properly than how you apply the liquid itself, okay? So what I want you to do, I want you to use pressure. Use pressure on the gadget, squeeze it in there and use pressure, okay? This is a special melanin sponge that will go into the surface like it brushes into the pores and really clean it. This is not a wet wipe, it's special made for Nanofixit. So once it's clean with this, you can turn it around, use it, spend at least 30 seconds cleaning this properly. Sometimes when they have an old screen protector from before, you need to spend even more time. Then take any paper tissue or a microfiber and make sure you wipe the device completely clean and dry, okay? So we do this and now 
The end result you want to see, if you look against the light, is a completely clean screen, no fat or residue on there whatsoever, so you know that when you put Nanofix it on it, it's gonna stick. This is very important, clean properly, okay? Then, take step number two. Inside here, you have a little uh, wipe. It's already uh, full of the Nanofixit liquid. The liquid is made in the US, in our laboratory in the US, and then we uh, pack it in Asia uh, and ship it all over the world. You just take this wet wipe on the phone, you rub it on the glass like this, don't use pressure, you don't need any pressure to do this, just very gently, make sure you cover every angle of it, and then take it and put it on top of the step two sachet. Just leave it there. Then you put the gadget down and you wait for a minute. If you try a phone prior to applying Anofixit and you put water on it, as I talked about before, you will probably see it's not very hydrophobic. It will be quite hydrophobic after Nanofixit is applied. And this is really a way of proving to the customer that the product is there. It's pretty cool. We're gonna look at that again. After about a minute, you let this dry. If you do demonstrations to clients, this is an awesome time to now talk about the benefits of Nanofixit, right? When this is drying, you talk about the benefits of the product, uh, you tell them about the antibacterial feature, anti-radiation, clarity of the screen, that this fits all devices, it lasts for one year, etc, etc, etc. After one minute, you take the microfiber that is inside step three, and you just buff it gently. Again, no pressure here, no rubbing, just do it gently, okay? Rub it around there. Gently turn the microfiber around. And what you want to see again is a crystal clear screen, okay? So now you apply it once. Guess what? We're gonna do it again. We did a lot of testing and we found that when you apply two layers of Nanofixit, it makes it even better. So again, from number two, take the same wipe, it's still wet. You apply it onto the screen. You could also flip it around. You never know where the Nano is. Flip it around all over the screen. Then, second time, dab a little bit on the camera lens. So rub that a little bit, just get it wet. And you can talk about to the client about the benefits of putting this on the camera lens. Enhanced quality of pictures, protecting the glass, of course, from falling, scratches, etc. So that's good. Leave it down again and leave it for another minute. After another minute, take step number three and rub that on again like this. After you have done this, the way I've now shown you, you have done a perfect application of Nanofixit and the customer will be very happy about the results. After you clean the screen, remember to also clean the camera lens of the customer and give it to the customer to enjoy. Okay, now we're gonna do the fun part, which is demonstrating the product, which I have done thousands of times around the world, and I never get tired of it. It's great fun. Why? Because when you see the faces of the people and the big factor, they're like, yeah, this is cool, this is cool. They get really excited, they tell their friends. If you do a good demonstration, for sure, the sale will be done. So now we're gonna demonstrate a little bit what we do on the exhibitions and also what we do in our stores like this that we have placed so different places around the world. So, uh, first of all, when you demonstrate, it's very important to have your different tools available. So, what you're going to have is you're going to have some kind of demo phone. What we do is we either take glass like this, some uh, ordinary glass for whatever phone that works for you, or we have uh, dummy phones like this, which has the real glass on top like this. Uh, we have this, then of course, we have a fork, which uh, has a very visual image on how to scratch the phone because people wouldn't put a fork on their phone, would they? So it's very dramatic, it's almost like a magic trick. It's pretty cool, and yes, you cannot scratch it with a fork. Uh, then, we're gonna take it to the next level, which is this razor cutter. This is very, very sharp, and please do not cut your fingers. Be careful. Okay, so these are the tools we have. In addition to that, we have a lovely little bottle of water that can show the hydrophobic effect of the gadgets. All right, so the first thing we're gonna say is we're gonna, we're gonna talk about tempered glass. 
And I think a really good way to demonstrate this and to talk to people about it is to, for yourself, you can compare tempered glass with something old fashioned. Like I did before, this is a vinyl record, Nanofixit is MP3, okay? So we're now gonna challenge the vinyl record with the MP3 and see who wins. Take a piece of tempered glass like this. We normally get it because many people, of course, they buy Nanofixit. We take off their tempered glass off their phone and we put that at the side. So we always have a lot of tempered glass lying around where we present this product. So we can demonstrate A, that many people already trusted the product and purchased the product because here is their old tempered glass. And B, we use it for demonstrations like this. So what you wanna do, you wanna take the tempered glass and put it here you can see it here, on half of the screen, okay? So you see, this is where you have applied Nanofixit, and this is tempered glass. We are going to use the cutter, and as you can see here, when you put it down, you're gonna see a big scratch in the tempered glass. And then, take it down to the glass here, and do that a couple of times to demonstrate to the consumer. So basically, here's what you do. Okay, now we're gonna see the comparison Tempered glass, the old fashioned, good old tempered glass that you all know, compared to Nanofixit, the number one liquid screen protector in the world. So, this is Nanofixit that we already applied. This is what you know and what you think is so awesome tempered glass. Check this out. Okay, so I'm gonna use this. This is very sharp. I'm gonna go down there. I use a lot of pressure. I can see a big scratch in the glass and I go down here and it just slides. Do it again. And harder. You see? quite impressive and it really works, okay? Now, the next thing we do is to demonstrate it that we don't have any scratches. So, we take off the tempered glass, we gently buff off this glue and everything out of the tempered glass, and we see, see? There is no scratches on this surface whatsoever. So, again, Nanofixit wins compared to tempered glass. Chicka ching pretty good. So this is the way we demonstrate that. So always try to have tempered glass around to do this type of demonstration because it's very convenient <clears throat> if you can have time to do it. Now if you don't have tempered glass around and you just want a demo on your demo phone, it's quite cool to give people something that they can't hurt themselves with. A fork, which you use every day, and your demo phone, okay? So you go and see, you say to them, yes I applied Nanofix to this surface, Here's a fork. You don't use a fork on your, or on your phone normally, do you? You take the fork and just rub it on the screen like this. You can also take the back of the fork and hammer it and say, it's very hard, it's 9H hardness. It's very hard, it's 9H hardness. And yes, you can't even scratch it with a fork. Nanofixit is very highly scratch resistant against the normal tear and wear. Uh, you know, keys, coins, putting it in the pocket, dropping the phone, etc. It makes glass up to six times stronger. It's 9H+. Plus. It's almost as hard as a diamond. Very strong. And ultra scratch resistant. Hand the telephone and this fork over to the customer and ask them to try themselves. And they will do like this with the corner of the phone. They always do for some reason. The <laughs> corner on the phone and the corner of the fork and do like this. And they just do it here. They don't really like what you did. They just do it here. I don't know why, but that's what they do. And then they look, wow, that really works. And then you say, okay, would you like the three-in-one for the family or would you like Nanofixit phone? So these two tools, very, very useful, simple demonstration to do, okay? Now, many people ask us, how do you see that Nanofixit is on the phone or not? This is where your little water bottle comes in. So here, you take uh, the phone, you put a drop on the side. You could put many drops actually. You see, they just purl like strings of water. Now here's the trick. Take the phone and slowly, slowly tip the phone. And you can see the water going to the edge and then you can see the water going all off. And now you just have dry surface, okay? dry surface. This creates a lot of attention everywhere we go. So put the drop on and what I do because Nanofixit makes the surface so slippery that you actually can take your finger, you touch the uh, bubble here, you move that over and now you have one bubble. So water cannot stick to the glass. Again the water has uh, come off the glass and it's completely dry.
So the hydrophobic test, very nice way to demonstrate the product and people really enjoy it. And that's something that tip people from going from tempered glass to nano fix it and uh, assisting us in this wonderful job we have on educating people. So this is how you can demonstrate NanoFixit and how you can get people to understand that it's there and believe in the product. NanoFixit is a surface protection company. We don't only have the screen protector. We have more nanotechnologies that will help the consumers in their gadget protection and gadget health. NanoFixit has the liquid screen protector. We have the gadget sanitizer that protects the phone for 30 days from germs, virus and bacteria. All the size of the phone, it works on plastic, uh, rubber, metal, uh, even on leather. Uh, we have the famous scratch remover that removes scratches from the surface of the phone if the consumer already have scratches on their phone. They can first remove the scratches, then apply NanoFixit to the screen. Okay, and also separately, we made Radiation Shield, which is uh, a product similar to NanoFixit, uh, original liquid. We tweaked it a little bit to focus more on the radiation because some people like their tempered glass, but how about just putting on Radiation Shield on top of the tempered glass? Yes, it works on tempered glass or without tempered glass. So, this is a product to capture the whole audience that uses tempered glass or just want to have NanoFixit. And yes, you can apply NanoFixit and then you can apply Radiation Shield on top if you also want to do double Radiation Shield, okay? So, NanoFixit has a whole range of products. Please go to our website, learn a little bit about the product, go to YouTube, check out the YouTube channel we have and see the latest update there and maybe there's some news there, okay? So, with this, I hope that we educated you a bit, that you can understand more how to promote and sell the product. It is very important to, of course, interact with the customers. The customer are used to buying tempered glass and now we want them to switch from the old-fashioned wine and record over to the latest MP3. It is your job to educate the consumers and work with this new exciting products and make excited, happy customers. The difference between NanoFixit and tempered glass is that if you give somebody a phone and they put tempered glass on it, they're not going to talk to their friends about it. They can maybe show them their new phone, but if they put NanoFixit on their new phone, they actually get more excited about their phone and they start telling their customers about it. They will also come back to you because after a year, they will go back because they want to reapply NanoFixit. So this is a recurring business model too, okay? And I often say to people, <laughs> if you want to upgrade your new phone, what are you going to do? What can you do? What if I told you that iPhone had just came out with the ordinary iPhone model and then the iPhone Elite series? The iPhone Elite phone was the same phone, but it had added benefits. It already had a built-in screen protector with 9H plus hardness, so you didn't get scratches on your phone. The surface was completely self-cleaning antibacterial, so you didn't get those bacteria and germs on your phone. And there was a radiation shield already built into the phone that reduces radiation from the iPhone with like 90%. Now, this model, let's say, was $100 more expensive. Would you buy the ordinary Apple phone or the Apple Elite model? Here's the point. Every phone can become the Elite model. All you gotta do is apply NanoFixit to the surface of the phone. And now you have an upgraded device for the customer. Happy customer, happy business, happy days. See you soon.